Okay. What story am I gonna tell today? Fart story. Okay, so every morning during my wake up pee, I let it rip. And by let it rip, I mean I rip a huge ass morning fart. Pretty sure I don't flatulate in my sleep, so all that gas just builds up overnight. And these morning farts, they're oh, huge! Yeah. Now our bathroom window is normally open, and that window is connected to an alley which touches other bathroom windows. We are approximately six months into the pandemic lockdown here in California. And consistently, throughout this quarantine, after my morning rip, some person responds with a few morning farts of their own from across the alleyway. Yes, usually multiple farts. As if to assert some form of fart dominance. I think we might be dealing with some form of alpha farter. A fart chad, if you will. A fart chad. Fart chad. <laughs> if you know me, you may know that I'm pretty s skilled skilled at um let's just say I have good fart embouchure meaning I have pretty good fart control like I could fart on cue um like if you were ever my roommate you may be aware of you're certainly aware of fart battles so what's a fart battle let's say for the sake of argument let's say that it's a Saturday morning. You're awake, but you want to laze around a bit in bed because it's Saturday. You stretch out a little, toss and turn, but you don't fart. Don't fart. Because remember, you have a roommate. You don't want to disturb them. You don't want to wake them up. But then you notice that your roommate is rolling around too. Maybe you see them on their phone. The point is, they're awake. So, you let it rip. But then, your beloved roommate has the audacity. The audacity to fart back. And that's where you assert your fart dominance. I'm getting the last fart in, buddy. So that's basically a fart battle where one competitor farts, the other competitor farts back in return, the first person farts back, and so on and so on. Fart, 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 fart. You know, a fart battle. Last fart standing. <laughs> Not to toot my own horn, but I've won my fair share of fart battles. And I'm gonna let you in on an old industry secret on how I win fart battles. The winning strategy in my experience is fart control. Don't just, I cannot stress this enough, don't just let it rip. You gotta let some of it rip. You know, so you don't blow your load all at once. You know what I mean? You gotta fart out teensy little poots. This is why fart control is so important. It's on here. You gotta save that fuel for the end game. Strategy. And from my experience, fart battle competitors usually lose these morning fart battles because they only had one or two farts in them. And when I win, I just, in reality, I just had one, one big fart, which I released in small increments at a time per each of my turns in a fart battle. So when I win, I actually have some gas in reserve and just 
release it all as a victory fart. So what's with this fart chad across the alleyway? Are we rivals? Nemeses? Lovers? Will I ever see their face eye to eye? And more importantly, should I challenge them in fart battle? <laughs> and to that I have to say, if you've made it this far into the video, why would you think that I haven't already? And one. And one.